recording. Hello, everybody. Um, as we've always agreed to, uh, today's session is going to be in English because last one was in French. So welcome everyone to this other session of um, uh, Zoom training for uh, Century Heng Yue uh, Mall America. Um, I hope you didn't have to go through the other people go through. Uh, I'm pretty sure your downlines have been calling you uh, to find out why they weren't able to trade or why they weren't getting their money, even though we, we, we went past the day number 12. Um, I hope you could find words to reassure them that whenever you have a system migration like the one we had in uh, last weekend, uh, you have to expect some little troubles. Plus, for those who are wondering why they're not getting any money, just make sure you tell them that whenever there's a migration, the time stops for everybody, including the uplines. So some of you as upline are going through the same issues and not get your money on the day we're supposed to get it. So just explain that to them. And if they want, show them your account, show them your past due account and uh, make them understand that it's not just them, it's everybody. And that the, the company is working hard to fix this problem. Um, so today, we're just gonna continue with uh, the discovery of the new platform. Uh, you know, finding where things are and see how, how to, to access them. Um, <clears throat> one major thing that I notice uh, in my personal case is that when you're using a new phone, you have the latest version of Android on your phone. You will not be able to install the app. I don't know if any of you guys have experienced that, but if you're using the latest version of Android, you won't be able to install the new app on your phone because the company hasn't uh, put it on uh, Play Store yet, on Google Play Store. I guess they're still working on having that uploaded. But because it doesn't come from Google Play Store, Google does not allow you to install it. Now, in the past, we were able to, to just push a button to tell Google, accept apps from unknown source or sources. And uh, that was the bypass to install whatever app you had that did not come from Google Play Store or, or maybe your phone, your own phone uh, store. So now it's that my phone and uh, my tablet and uh, two other phones that I've tried out, I could not get the, the app to install on it. Luckily, I had an old phone laying around that I could, uh, I could put the app on and it uh, it works so that that is just because that particular phone doesn't have the latest android version so i brought that up with um with the company already so they know about it they know that it's an issue so and they're working hard are at resolving it uh today we're gonna look at um today we're gonna look at uh, different things that we normally would do on a on a, on an account we are going to um, convert uh, century points into consumption points. We're going to create an invitation link. We're going to create an account from the network diagram. So we're going to look at all that to give like uh, a big overview of what should be done when we uh, you know, in a new account on a new platform, whenever we need to create one. So we're gonna to touch like uh, several different operations that you guys need to know uh, to know about. Not that you didn't know, but uh, it's gonna be new for all every one of us on the new platform. <clears throat> all right, so allow me now to share my platform with you. <clears throat> Can you all see my screen? Yes. 
Yeah, I can see it. Okay, thank you. All right, so let me log into this, this leader's account. And um, so basically money got transferred into, into his account. So we're gonna go into his account. <clears throat> And, uh, and then we're going to transfer the money from his, um, from his highest account into the new account that we want to create. So let's get into his account first. So his username is this and then this and then the password is where's the password okay let me see okay the password oh my god very complicated you know what preparing for this i actually set it up so that i could just go and copy it So here is right. Oh, nice. The system is faster. Faster than it was like about an hour ago. So basically I'm logging into the account. We you you saw me uh click on skip there. Um I believe that that uh, thing that you get, that uh, box or communication box that you get, that prompt, is what we will be using whenever we, we lose our password and then uh, we have to create a new password or to reset our password. Uh, we're still waiting for all the information to uh, make them available to all of you to explain every little bit of uh, how the platform works. So now we are on um, this guy's account. You can see it here. And uh, we can go on personal center to see where, uh, how much money he's got. Uh, one, thing, one thing that I prefer on the phone, like the version of the app on the phone, is that you have the little wallet that you could click on on your phone and it will show you all your points and everything that we don't have here on, or maybe I don't know where it is. I haven't found it yet. Maybe if you have, just let me know. But this is the way that I get in to see my finances. Or maybe not even here, sorry. I go to mine, let me move this, mine. And then when I go to mine, I can see how many salary points I've got here. Huh? Okay. Um, who sees a problem right now on this account? Can someone tell me if he's seeing a problem on this account? The consumption point is too high. Exactly. Is that the problem? The consumption point is too high. Uh, yeah. we, are, we, we loaded this account this morning or during the day. And uh, I'm not sure what he got. I hope he did not go ahead and change all his points into consumption points because we had this discussion already with him, me, uh, myself and him. I hope he didn't do that because, uh, or maybe he just received the points in consumption points instead of receiving them in salary points. Where would I go to find out what type of point, what type of point he received. Currency oh. flow. Sorry? Currency flow. Um, currency flow, that's one option, but there's another place where I could see that directly. But yes, currency flow is definitely one option. We can go and look at currency flow. Uh, so when we click at currency flow, we see it here that the P2P transfer that was sent to him, 
All right. Okay, currency X. Mm -hmm. Okay, we see here, we see here that the money was sent to him 3,000 uh, century points. You see that? Yeah. Yes. And then he exchanged the currency, the, the, the century points into consumption points. Yeah. And now he only has got consumption points. So this is how you can track back what happened to an account. If somebody tells you, oh, how come I don't have this or how come I didn't get paid? You go into your currency flow, okay? I was gonna go direct uh, and thank you for your suggestion, uh, Elvira. I was going to go into P2P transfer because he got his a point transfer from uh, the service center. And I knew that. So I was going to go to P2P transfer. And then in P2P transfer, normally in the old account, we would have that. We would have a history of all the P2P transfers. I see here now that we don't have that anymore. So the only way to see that would be to go into your currency flow because it will show all the um, currency exchanges, all the financial transactions you had on your account. And this is how we now... Pastor. Who is this? This is Sosten. I think you can see it by clicking on uh, P2P transfer record. Okay, maybe I missed that one. Let me go back to P2P transfer. Nice to have you here today, uh, Sosten. <laughs> okay, oh yeah, that's right. I didn't see this guy. All right, so P2P transfer record. Yeah, exactly. So basically, super, super 10,000 on the 18, which basically is today, sent him this amount. Okay, sent him this amount and then uh, sent him this amount afterwards. Um, I don't know why he exchanged it to uh, consumption points. And um, the thing is, when we talked about this, I mentioned to him not to make this mistake. And I reminded him not to make this mistake, but I guess it's too late now. Um, and you guys already know how we, how we deal with this. Now we need to find anybody who's, um, who's going to be creating some account to, to, to get, you know, to change some of these. So he was planning to, he was planning to change uh, some of these into, uh, no, he was planning to create some, uh, VIP five accounts, um, but now we kind of in a poor situation. So what I'm gonna do? I have some. Um, I have some. Uh, I was gonna say salary points. I have some century points. You notice that I call them century points, just so I don't call them C H Y points. I call them century points. Century is the first uh, letter of C H uh, Y. C H Y standing it's for century. Right. Did you say anything? Yeah, how many how many VIP five account he, he wanted to create? Two. Two. But we can still do it since it's consumption points, we can do it going through the diagram. Yes, but you're gonna you're not gonna be able to do the trading part. Right. Mm -hmm. So we will still create we will still create the uh, the account. So we're gonna do the parts with just not we're not just we're just not going to be able to do the complete uh, thing. But who knows? By the end, I may find uh, a solution. I think I have some cyber points um, that I have to transfer to somebody else that I can deal with. Um, all right. So now you see a, an example of a mistake that uh, new, new, uh, new partners tend to do or to make. So try to talk to your... Um, Try to talk to your downlines to avoid this type of mistake. So, going from here, let's look at uh, how to create an invitation link. Okay, so invitation link, 
we go to my services and then we have invitation link right here and uh, before we even do this i would like to show you the frequently asked questions under the frequently asked questions here um, chy chy actually came up with some um, some of the answers for the most asked questions like how to activate the account how to withdraw uh, how to enjoy world expo how to recharge how to promote your business okay so how to promote your business is how to create your invitation link basically and if we go in there we click on that you'll see that it shows you it tells you the step it doesn't show with images or something or a video but it show, it tells you the steps that you need to follow to do it now let's go back to um let's go back to creating our uh invitation link So creating our invitation link, we go to my services on the left, and then we click on invitation link. And then on envi um, here, we have the sponsor, uh, sorry, the service center, the referral, he's sponsoring his own two new accounts and the position. Now, when you are in his position, what you need to do is to go to your network diagram and follow, as we said, the uh, weaker leg so that most people in your diagram can benefit from the service profit and the um, uh, chain service profit. So we're going to go to his, we're going to go to his uh, network diagram, which is here. So let's hope that it works. Okay, it seems to be working. I know some people were complaining they weren't able to see their network diagram. So I see that he actually created one of the accounts already. So, which is good. Um, now we're going to create the link using this position here. So we see that he's the only account activated on his network diagram. This type is very easy because the position is right there and you don't even need to think before you can pick this position. So he's going to be the sponsor as well as the um, what we used to call the uh, resettlement. All right. So now we can go back to invitation link. Now that we know exactly what position it's going to be, it's going to be a position on the right of the top account. So invitation link. So the service center is already selected. Um, referrals ID is himself. Place ID. You notice that sometimes the system automatically selects something. That name that is there, you can do, delete it if you don't want to go to that position. So basically we can delete it and say, no, we want to put on the right of the, uh, the referral, which is this position now. So basically he's the sponsor and he's he is also the uh, the resettlement. Okay, so now we're going to create the link. So when we click on creating the link, now we have the link here. And this is what we copy to send to a potential uh, prospect. Before we used to have, um, before you, we need to select, we needed to select the link. Now it's already there. We have a copy button that we could just click and then it will copy the link for us. If we want to send that link to somebody, we can do so now. So basically, if I want to send it to, uh, who can I send it to? I could send it to, let me see this. Let's send it to, uh, okay, let's send it to Billy. For example, this is just an example. And there you go. I've sent the link to somebody who could use it to, uh, to, to create the account. Keep in mind now, you send the link. When you, the link, using the link is the only way you can create an account without consumption points. If you wanna create the account by clicking on, on, the, actual, um, on the actual empty spot, 
you will need to have consumption points. Otherwise, it will not work, all right? So this is now the link. And if Billy was the one that I was sending the link to, he would click on the link. He would click on the link. And then the link will open up the form for him to fill out to create the new account, all right? So basically, this is the form. Not so much different from what we, we, we used to, to, to know. So language is English, uh, username, I'll enter the username that he asked me to use. Uh, that was, give me a second here. So the username, uh, okay, Julie Sal A01. Okay, so the username is just Okay, so that's the username AA. What happened there? Julissa A01. All right. So, so the referrals ID is here. The placer ID is here. The placer is what we used to know as the resettlement. Um, and then this is the position that we selected when we created the link. This is the service center code or ID, and we want it to be a VIP5, so we click on the drop down list here, and we pick VIP5. You may see now that there are more VIPs coming, but they haven't decided yet how they're gonna look like. Everybody's waiting, so we pick VIP5. The country is USA, so we're gonna pick USA on this one. Uh, USA, where are you? USA. Um, so detailed address. Uh, let me see what his address was. Okay, we'll just put Illinois and then password. I'll enter just something easy to remember. so that he can change it after. Uh, email address. Um, we, we're gonna leave this for now. And then we'll say register. Uh, whoever is listening to music, could you please uh, mute your mic? Thank you. Oh, I need to select, I need to say that I've agreed to the registration protocol, I missed that. So now I can click register. Please fill in the six digit alpha, uh, six digit and alpha numerical login password. All right. Oh, it has to be six digit alpha numerical. All right. So my, what I, what I had entered was all um, numbers and I guess that's why it's asking me this. so I'm gonna add a letter to it. Okay. All right. I need to write that down. Now let's try it again. Member number already exists. Member number already exists. Okay. Um, have you guys encountered this one? I don't know what it means. Member number already exists. Okay, so now I'm changing something on the username. I don't know if the username was a problem. So let's see what it says now. Okay, this location has been occupied. Please select another one. Okay. Uh, this location was not occupied. Why is it taking so long? Um, 
So I don't know why it's saying this, but normally we filled out everything that needed to be filled out and uh, it should normally work. Okay, member number already exists. I'm not sure what it means. So all I can do now is get out of here and see if I can Can anybody help here? I'm kind of stuck now. And uh, another thing I don't even see from here, if it doesn't work, I don't see how to go back to, uh, to the previous screen. Okay. So oh, basically I was trying to fill this out. So this is not working. I'm not sure why it's work. It's not working. So we're gonna find out later why it's not working. But, uh, sorry. Yes, I got something to say about that. Maybe. Yes, uh, yes, uh, leader Serge. So maybe because the, the referral and the sponsor are the same. Oh uh, no, that that, that shouldn't be a problem. That shouldn't be a problem. We had. Uh, if you are the first, if you, you have an account and you're creating a second or a third account, you always the referral and, and, the, and the resettlement. So that shouldn't be the problem. Anyway, let's leave this like this and then, and then we, can, uh, we will create the account uh, using the regular way. Is somebody talking to, to me or if you're making this noise from your side, please kind of, uh, mute your mic. Somebody want to say something? All right. Okay. So basically with the link, for some reason it didn't work. So let's try the other way. We already have consumption points anyway. So the second way to create an account is to go through the network diagram. So by clicking on the network diagram and by clicking on register right here, look at that. Isn't this amazing? Now I see going in the network diagram that uh, the position is taken. Um, I hope that while we're doing this, the guy is not doing it uh, himself. I don't know. Because this would be funny. Anyway, I don't think this year went through. So it is quite possible that he's doing it himself. And, um, and that could explain why the position were taken. So he's doing, he might be doing it himself. Um, I'll, I'll try and uh, touch base with him when, when uh, this year goes, um, when we reach the end of this first session. But it looks very much like uh, he's doing it uh, while we are in his account, even though he did ask me to do it for him. So, um, Anyway, it's yes. there now. We can, we can, so the next step now, what is the next step? Who can tell me what the next step is? Maybe we have to activate your accounts. How? For activate the code now. How? Be a VIP. Become, become a VIP. No, you cannot become a VIP yet. Is the money is the um oh, let me let me check what he's got because let me check because I don't think he's transferred anything into the, these accounts. Okay, you have to transfer consumption points. Exactly. So we should start by transferring consumption points to this account. And if we go, if we check the uh, P2P transfer record, um, I'm pretty sure. Uh, sorry, not there. But if we check under um, the homepage, I'm pretty sure he still has all the consumption points. So that means he hasn't transferred any consumption points to, to the newly created account in order to, uh, in order to uh, activate the account. So I'm not sure if he knows that, but um, now that he's created the account, I won't even be able to do that because I'm not sure what password he used 
creating the new accounts. So that is the problem that we will have. Um, so in two minutes, the, uh, this video is gonna end. In two minutes, this video is gonna end. So we could look at, um, what could we do now? Anyway, there's not much we can do in two minutes. Uh, we looked at how to create a VI, uh, uh, an invitation link. It just didn't work because he had already created an account in that position. Uh, otherwise, it would have worked. Um, but you know what? We could actually create, we'll, we'll go ahead since we're in here and create a new link in a position that he hasn't used yet, just so to see it go all the way. So basically, we will create a new a new uh, we'll register a new account under this position here. So I'll just go ahead and hit create. The system has chosen this position. So I hit create. It will create the link, as you can see. And uh, sometimes when you have a link, if you want, for example, to change the position of this link, if you want it instead of left to be on the right, you could change it just here with the number by going from one to two. This is a quick tip. So now I'm gonna say copy. I'm gonna say copy. Now I've copied the link and uh, I'm going to send the link as I did last time here. I'm gonna click on the link and we're going to quickly create the new position, all right? So we're gonna call it uh, A A A A. Um, so left, everything is spelled out. So we're gonna give it a VIP three, um, and then link country. We're gonna say it's uh, Belgium. Uh, detail address. We're gonna give it a funny address. Um, one one one. Okay, 